it carefully. You understand that? Examine means to inspect or observe carefully, to look into the state or view in all aspects in order to find out the facts or the physical condition to scrutinize, to investigate, and to inquire into, examine as it appeals to a ship to know whether she is seaworthy. You understand that now? We are vessel, the Apostle Paul said, I beseech you, brethren, by the mercy of God, present your body a living sacrifice. Our body is a vessel of the Lord. And listen here, children of God, we need to examine these vessels. These vessels of us, we need to examine them and see if the vessel is seaworthy. Because let me tell you, children of God, the storm is coming. The storm is coming. So the Syrians sing the song, so the storm pass over. But the storm ain't pass over yet. The storm is coming, and we need to get these vessels in order, and we need to see them worthy. If they got any small leaks, we need to patch them up. What you say about it? Amen. We need to patch them up because they told me a little leak would sink a big ship. And, and so if we don't examine these values and examine these ships, when we go out there in the ocean and the storm come down, we have no way to stand. Amen. But if we get these ships seaworthy, we'll be able to stand. What you say about that? And um, I fear the Lord, his majesty will take hold of me. Women's value mean righteousness. That's the first thing. Value mean righteousness. And he went on to say goodness, charity, and power. Let's have these qualities in us during this convention. And let's see the time this convention over. You see, if we take a time and examine ourselves, we won't have to know what our sisters and brothers are doing. It's easy for you to examine somebody else. But the scripture is saying, examine yourself, examine your value, and examine your ship. And see if it's seaworthy. Now, by the grace of God, I have plenty more good things to tell you, woman, how precious you are in the sight of God. The women had the daughter. The daughter was grievously vaxxed with the devil until they couldn't do nothing. But she come, falling down at the feet of Jesus, weeping and wiping Jesus' feet and saying, Lord, help me. My daughter is grievously vaxxed with the devil. And the disciples say, oh, do, master, don't let this woman come near you. You don't know who she is. She is this and that. But Jesus say, woman, as thy fate is, so be it done unto you. And when she went home, her daughter was made whole. God bless you tonight. God bless you in a special way. Pray for me. I'm not physically well, but in my heart, I'm rejoicing in the God of my salvation. And I want to say to these precious lady here tonight, don't worry. Don't worry, sister. Just be happy. God bless you. Amen.